In this really short video, I'm going to tell you whether or not you actually need too soft or any other fabric medium when painting on canvas shoes like Converse All Stars or Vans. The theory is, is that acrylic paint in general usually isn't flexible enough to be able to go onto soft surfaces like canvas without cracking like this. So fabric medium additives to your paint like Angelus Too Soft or GSC 900 are intended to make your paint more flexible so that this cracking doesn't occur. This seems quite reasonable until you consider the fact that these additives are really, really expensive and you need to use more and more paint in order to develop a solid layer than you would without. And beyond all of that, it feels like you're adding just another step to the already complex process of customizing sneakers. Now you have to add in paint additives and heat drying in order to set the medium. It can be a bit of a headache, but it's textbook and I've been doing this for a couple of pairs now. Angelus Brand, the manufacturers of the world's leading sneaker paint, Angelus Acrylic, released a video on how to customize fabric shoes. And in this video, they state that you really only need to use the fabric medium mix on the base coat layer, and that any subsequent layers don't really need that 50-50 mix. So one day I reached out to a really amazing artist whose detail work was just absolutely blowing my mind. And I asked her if she even uses a fabric medium because her work was so smooth. And to my shock, she said, nope, she doesn't add anything to her paint, just paint. So what does one do with these conflicting sources? Angela says, this is made for our paint, use it for its purpose. My experience says, it works well enough, but it has some downsides. And my new hero says, nah, overrated. So I decided to do a little experiment. When customizing this pair of canvas bands for a young customer, I decided to use the fabric medium on one shoe and not the other shoe to see how it goes. So the shoe on the left is our shoe with the paint additive and the shoe on the right is the control shoe that is just straight paint. After doing a base coat, I did a little pressure test to see how flexible the paint looks on the two shoes and compared the results. At first glance, it seems as though the additive shoe with the fabric medium looks just a bit more flexible than the other. Fast forward all the masking and spraying and painting and details and we have a completed pair of shoes. After adding the same clear coat sealant to both shoes, it's time to see how the two compare in terms of flexibility. Well, surprisingly, they're much the same, or at least I can't see or feel a notable difference. So what does this mean? It means that Too Soft is Angelus's propaganda lies. I'm just kidding. No, here are a couple of key takeaways. If you're working on a really small pair of shoes that doesn't require much flexibility because of the structure of the shoe, you can probably get away without using any Too Soft or paint additive because the shoe is not flexing anyway. But if you're using giant size 12, size 13 man's shoe, then there will be a whole lot more flexibility and you might want to consider using a little bit of softener. But when it comes to just ordinary size shoes, I think I'm going to start leaving the step out. I'm perfectly happy with how this came out. And even with the little squeeze test, you can see that this paint is not going to crack. I would conclude that Angela's paint is simply flexible enough to get by without any help. But bear in mind that this does not apply to all acrylic paints. Please don't walk away from this thinking that you can use any acrylic paint with or without fabric medium. No, that's not the point. In fact, the point is the complete opposite. Angelus itself specifically seems to be able to handle the flex test on its own. So in conclusion, I would say use the additive if you want, but if you don't, I wouldn't stress about it. The only other paint that I also know that this is true for, for customizing sneakers, is check out the next video to find out more. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I'm not gonna leave you hanging. The other brand is called Alpha Flex. Alpha Flex has the same stellar flexibility as Angelus and was actually a paint that was recommended to me while doing research for this video. I really hope that you found this video helpful. If you'd like to watch me struggle to paint this impossibly small little pair with all of its tiny little things, check out this video over here. 
I guarantee at least it'll be entertaining.